Are you worried about your finances or you feel stuck financially? You have come to the right place. In today's video, I will share 10 changes that will change your life in 2024. Stick to the end as the ninth step is my favorite because it has helped change my financial status. Are you ready? Let's find out together. Read books on finance. We all desire financial stability and success, right? The path to achieving financial goals begins with education because knowledge is power. Reading a book on finance is a fantastic way to gain valuable knowledge and insights that can truly transform your financial situation. The first way reading a finance book can help you is by enhancing your financial literacy. It equips you with a solid foundation or understanding personal finance principles, budgeting, investing, and wealth creation. By learning the fundamentals, you will become more confident in managing your money effectively. The second benefit is the exposure to diverse perspectives and strategies. Finance books are written by experts who have studied and experienced different financial situations. These books offer a range of strategies and insights that can be applied to your own unique circumstances. You'll discover new ways to earn, save, and invest, enabling you to make informed decisions that align with your personal goals. Summarily, reading a finance book provides actionable steps and practical tips. Authors often share proven strategies and techniques that have worked for them or others. These actionable steps can guide you in taking control of your finances, helping you develop better spending habits, setting achievable goals, and creating a roadmap for your financial success. What will my mentor do? Reading a book exposes you to the thinking patterns of many successful people today. Therefore, you can learn from their successes and failures. Therefore, take some time to ask yourself, what will my mentors do? Will he spend $100 on new clothes? For instance, Warren Buffett is a man known for his minimalist lifestyle. So making someone like him a mentor means you must follow his spending pattern to be successful financially as he is. Alternatively, you can decide to follow the steps of Robert Kiyosaki. He also favors spending less and saving more. The lesson here is that before you spend on anything, ask yourself what your mentor will do in a similar situation. If your decision follows the pattern you have seen from that person, go ahead and spend or buy whatever you want. However, if the answer is no, keep that money for later. Ultimately, I am asking you to copy another person's lifestyle choices. Nonetheless, it is a strategy that has helped avoid many money pitfalls and can help you too. Apply compound interest. Compound interest is when you earn interest not only on your initial investment, but also on the accumulated interest over time. Essentially, your money starts to work for you. Now, let me illustrate this with an example. Let's say you invest $1,000 in a savings account with an annual interest rate of 5%. After one year with compound interest, your investment would grow to $1,050. But here's where it gets interesting. Instead of withdrawing the interest, you keep it in the account. Over time, your investment will continue growing faster because that interest will also generate more interest. Therefore, the length of your investment is crucial. The longer you invest your money, the more time it has to compound and grow. Many people must avoid trying to time the market or constantly shifting their investments, but studies have shown that long-term investing generally provides better returns. Are you wondering where to invest to earn compound interest? Several options such as stocks, bonds, mutual funds, and even high-yield savings accounts are available. Conduct thorough research, assess your risk tolerance, and consult a financial advisor to determine the best investment strategy for your goals and circumstances. Look for free fun. It is okay to have fun and blow off steam, but you can spend less than $1,000 or more to accomplish this. It has been my experience that more spending doesn't equal more fun. So it is time to engage in activities that don't require spending a dime. You can create memorable experiences while saving your hard-earned money. My first suggestion is outdoor adventures. Mother Nature offers endless exploration and enjoyment free of charge. Go for a hike, picnic in a park, or take a leisurely bike ride. Not only will you save money, but you'll also improve your physical and mental well-being. You can even explore your local community for free events like festivals, concerts in the park, or outdoor movie screenings. These are great ways to have fun with friends and family while saving those precious dollars. Did you know that libraries are a treasure trove of free entertainment? You can find a wealth of resources without spending a penny, whether it's books, magazines, movies, or even online courses. Many people only consider the library as something besides a place to read, but that is only partially true. You can find many things to do in a public library, so it is best to take advantage of these cheap ways to have fun, and your pocket will thank you. Eat at home. 
Have you ever found yourself scrolling through your bank statements wondering where all your money went? I have been there. Eating out may seem convenient, but it can take a toll on your wallet. Let's break down the costs, shall we? First, restaurant dining often includes service charges and tips, which can add up quickly. Additionally, restaurant meal prices include labor, rent, and other overhead expenses. These factors make eating out significantly more expensive than cooking at home. Cooking at home is a game changer when it comes to saving money. Buying groceries and cooking your meals is generally more cost effective than eating out. You have more control over the ingredients and portion sizes, allowing you to stretch your dollars. Interestingly, you can prepare nutritious and delicious meals at a fraction of the cost of eating out with careful planning and budgeting. In addition, eating at home not only helps your finances, but also improves your overall health. You control the ingredients, portion sizes, and cooking methods when you cook your meals. You can choose healthier options and reduce excessive salt, sugar, and unhealthy fats. Furthermore, here are a few additional tips to making eating at home more enjoyable and financially beneficial. First, try to incorporate seasonal and locally sourced ingredients. They're often fresher and more affordable. Second, consider buying in bulk or taking advantage of sales and discounts. And finally, remember to pack leftovers for lunch, reducing food waste and saving money on workday meals. If you are enjoying this video, take a moment to like and subscribe to the channel to help me bring you more interesting videos. If you've done that, let's get back to the video. Be contented. Contentment is a state of mind characterized by satisfaction and acceptance of one's current circumstances without constantly yearning for more. It's about finding joy and gratitude in what you already have rather than constantly chasing after the next big thing. This step will help you in several ways change your finances in 2024. First, contentment can change your finances by reducing impulse spending. When you're content with what you have, you're less likely to make impulsive purchases driven by a desire for instant gratification. Instead, you become more mindful of your spending habits and make wiser financial decisions. To cultivate contentment and curb impulse spending, try implementing a 30-day rule. Whenever you feel the urge to buy something non-essential, wait for 30 days before making the purchase. During this time, reflect on whether the item aligns with your long-term goals and if it's essential. You'll be surprised how often your desire for that item disappears, saving you money. Here are some practical ways to cultivate contentment in your daily life. First, practice gratitude. Take a few minutes each day to reflect on what you are grateful for. It could be as simple as appreciating a beautiful sunset, a kind gesture from a friend, or a good meal. Second, engage in mindfulness practices such as meditation or deep breathing exercises. These practices help you become more present at the moment, allowing you to appreciate and find contentment in the here and now, rather than constantly chasing after future desires. Living in contentment is easy initially, but it is worth the effort. So I suggest you start planning this lifestyle change because 2024 is a few days away. Take control of your money. Do you want to stop living paycheck to paycheck in 2024? Then you have to take control of your money. Before you can take control of your money, it's crucial to assess your current financial situation. Start by understanding your income, expenses, and debts. Take a closer look at your spending habits and identify areas where you can make adjustments. This self-awareness will help you lay the foundation for positive change. Setting clear financial goals is the next step towards controlling your money. Ask yourself what you want to achieve financially in the short and long term. Do you want to pay off debt, save for a down payment, or start investing? Having specific goals gives you something to work towards and helps you stay motivated. Then you must create a budget and stick to it. A budget is a powerful tool that enables you to allocate your money wisely. Start by tracking your income and expenses meticulously. Categorize your expenses into essentials, housing, utilities, and groceries, and discretionary spending, entertainment, dining out, etc. Then, set limits for each category and ensure you stay within those limits. Remember, consistency is key. Diversify your income streams. If you've ever felt the weight of relying solely on one paycheck or one source of income, then it is a good thing you're watching this video. Income diversification means having multiple streams of income that come from different sources. It's like planting multiple financial seeds that have the potential to grow into substantial money trees. So why is diversification valuable? Well, for starters, it provides stability and security. 
Relying on a single income source leaves you vulnerable to unexpected changes like a job loss, economic downturn, or industry disruption. But when you have multiple income streams, you create a safety net that cushions you during these difficult times. Additionally, diversification brings increased financial freedom. How? Expanding your income sources gives you more control over your earnings. You won't be limited to one income ceiling or employer's decisions. Diversification gives you the power to create your own financial destiny. What are the ways I can diversify my income streams? Don't worry, I have good news for you. One of the most accessible ways to start diversifying is by offering your skills and services as a freelancer. Are you talented in writing, designing, programming, or marketing? With freelancing platforms available, you can turn your expertise into a side hustle. Earning extra income from different clients, it's a flexible and versatile option to consider. Another effective way to diversify is by investing. Now, we're not talking about making risky or impulsive decisions. Instead, we encourage you to educate yourself about different investment opportunities, such as stocks, bonds, real estate, or even starting a small business. You can build passive income streams that grow over time through wise investment. Invest for the future. Investing is a proven strategy for building wealth and achieving financial security. Instead of solely relying on your income, you can let your money work for you by investing in various assets such as stocks, bonds, real estate, or mutual funds. Over time, your investments have the potential to appreciate, provide regular income, and create a diversified portfolio that mitigates risk. Investing in the future helps you beat inflation in the coming months. Inflation erodes the purchasing power of your money over time. By investing, you can combat the effects of inflation. Historically, the returns generated by well-managed investments have outpaced inflation rates, ensuring that your wealth keeps pace with the rising cost of living. Investing allows you to preserve and grow your purchasing power over the long term. Furthermore, it is a strategy to help you earn from passive income streams. Whether through dividend-paying stocks, rental properties, or interest from bonds, investing can generate income without requiring continuous active effort. Passive income can provide financial stability, supplement your regular income, and create opportunities for financial freedom. Lastly, investing allows you to diversify your financial risk. Instead of relying solely on one income source, investing in different assets spreads your risk and reduces vulnerability to economic downturns or market volatility. Diversification can help protect your wealth and provide a buffer against unexpected financial challenges. Regular financial checking. Lastly, regularly track your progress towards your financial goals. Celebrate milestones along the way and make adjustments when necessary. Life circumstances and priorities change, so your financial plan should be flexible enough to accommodate them. Remember, changing your finances is an ongoing process. Moreover, regular financial checking allows you to spot any errors, discrepancies, or fraudulent activities early on. By being proactive and vigilant, you can protect yourself from financial mishaps and ensure your hard-earned money is secure. By taking the steps discussed in this video, you've already taken the necessary steps to improve your finances. Over time, these steps will lead to financial freedom and a more secure future. Thank you for watching today's video. If you found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more valuable content. Remember to leave your comments and questions down below. Until next time, take control of your finances and transform your financial future. We wish you all the best in the new year.